Hi guys, this is Rad and you are watching DIY Adventure Channel. I'm back after a few months break and uh, that was because of my personal reasons. But now, as I said, I'm back and I've got plenty of projects. Um, and we're starting today with something simple but practical. Um, I have that wax vacuum cleaner, carpet, wa carpet washing uh, vacuum cleaner. Uh, model 6531 which is quite old now but after a few years um, the vacuum carpet floor bit uh, nozzle just break down and it's actually the pin holding the, the nozzle and the pipe mounting piece uh, just fall apart and uh, the construction itself is very easy as you see on the video it's just a pin going through plastic wheels, and uh, I'm going to try. And, uh, I'm I'm going to, to fix it today. Uh, it's not expensive now. You can probably buy it for about ten pound or so. But uh, you know we've got the lockdown and coronavirus around the globe, and uh, we have to sit at home. So rather than go to the sh for shopping, I'm trying to keep myself busy, and. Uh, and as usual I'm saving money rather than spending them on the unnecessary unnecessary things. So rather than using the glue uh, or, or find different material I'm just thinking about doing something simple and there is a lot of forces working on that element uh, you know you're pushing and pulling uh, the pipe all the time and the forces working on the sides of it as well so that was the reason it's just uh, the wheels just start falling from the from the pin and then I was ending up with the pipe in my hand and the and the nozzle bead was sitting on the floor so I'm testing it is it uh, melting or not some of the plastics are not easy to melt this one actually is melting very easily so I hit it a little bit and flatten it and then I put on it the the, the wheel. So what I need to do, I need to form the bit of this plastic pin in the way to prevent uh, the wheel from falling from the pin. So I'm just taking the, one of the nails I have with the head big enough to go into the uh, hole of the wheel and I'm going to heat it up and then just squeeze it with a hot piece of nail and of course remember safety first so you should wear the gloves the eye, eye glasses and uh, protect yourself right So I'm gently just pushing the pin inside the uh, plastic react and melt it. I'm just cooling it by blowing on it and uh, it's a, it's a industrial plastic so uh, just after it's cold I make sure that the wheel is still spinning. I'm trying to pull it off now and it's still holding and I can tell you now because it's about two weeks after I made this video it's still working and it's working properly so after a few years back I'm from buying this, this product, this Vax I'm still using it and it's working properly so um, I can only recommend it alright guys if you like it just uh, press subscribe and uh, give me a thumbs up and press the bell button for the info and uh, that's it for now thanks for watching